Okay, to start this granny square is with a slip knot. And I like this way. Make a loop. And this yarn is coming from the ball. Uh, put it inside in the loop. And pull. Okay, so when I have this big loop, I just put my hook inside like this. Okay? Well, okay, start with chain four. One, two, three, and four. Put your hook on the first chain and make a slip a stitch. Okay, so you already have a little circle. To start, um, the first road, the first road, make three chains. One, two, and three chain. Chain three. And this is the your first three chains is count one double crochet. Okay, so do two more double crochet. So it's one. And two. Make chain two. Three more double crochet. And also you're going to lose this tail. So this is the second and third chain two one and two make another three double crochet one two and this is the last double crochet chain two and make your last three double crochet one two and three chain two and you're go to going to the third chain one two three put your hook inside and make a slip a stitch okay this is how it looks the first road to start number two you're going to chain three one, two, three. This is one double crochet, but we need one more chain for make separations between your sets of double crochet. So chain one more, chain four in total, and go to the first corner. Make three double crochet. Chain two, one, two, three double crochet, one, two, and three, chain one, and go to the corner, okay, only on the corners we chain two, between corners we chain just one, Okay, chain two and three more so continue with this on to the end of this round okay okay I need one more double crochet to finish this road and chain one go to the third chain this is one two and three and make a slip stitch Okay, so remember on the last, uh, well, with this one you already finished your third row of granny square and it's already, you can see the square, it's already there. Okay, for the sec next row, for, if this is the fourth, it's a little bit different, like it's number two, four, six is going to be the same and three, five, seven the same okay for this one chain three well actually four because three of 
these four chains is count like one double per chain and the, the four chain is for separation okay so if you remember here on the third chain on the third chain I mean I'm sorry on the third row we chain three and it's already here and we make three double crochet for next row this one we chain three one more and we're going to work in here with um, three double crochet okay and is that's the only difference between the row okay so I hope uh, do you like this tutorial to make this granny square if you're not subscribed yet to my channel don't forget so you not miss any of my videos okay thank you for watching see you next time